guys and welcome back to another adventure. If you guys remember in our last video, we told you the very sad news that this is the last vacation video. Yes, the, today was our last day in Florida. But let's remember what happened first. Our parents told us to pack up our clothes for a big week vacation. But we didn't know where we were going. And so we packed up. And let me tell you, it was a super long drive. But we were also super excited. Oh, I remember it was a really long, long, long trip. But the good thing is that I slept a lot. Because we passed five states. Illinois, Kentucky, Tennessee, and Alabama. And then we finally arrived at Florida. Yay, we finally arrived. Yes, we arrived at Panama City Beach, Florida. And that's where our great adventure began. Let's go to the beach. Oh, I just love how I touched the sand for the first time and it was so magical. Oh, and the waves that were splashing us. I remember clearly that you brought a boat and the boat was actually sinking and the waves were tossing it over and it was so hard for you to get the boat back again. Oh yeah, I remember that I got it so fast. My favorite part was snorkeling underneath the water. I found so many shells and fishies that were actually bothering my feet. I got a bit cranky, but when I found beautiful shells, that made my day. Oh, what about the sunset? It was the most beautiful view. You know, sister, I also agree with you. It was the most beautiful beach vibe. It was the sun and the waves, and it just looked so beautiful. I don't know about you, sister, but the sunset had to be the most beautiful thing I ever saw. It looked like you were dizzy in the ocean. The waves were tossing you around. Yeah, I couldn't stand up because the waves were tossing me all over, just like you said. And I felt like I was dancing. When I got out of the water, it felt like I was still, well, in the water. On our second day, we went to walk all around Pier Park. When we started walking around, PR Park, we found so many beautiful things that, well, were from Florida, such as turtles, other stuff that aren't precisely in our state. I like to walk around PR Park. I love to get on this boat because it was the best thing ever, spinning and splashing around the water. When we started walking around the pier park, it all looked so nice and cool. I wanted to buy everything there. And at the end, there was this huge pier park sign. We took so many photos there. It looked so beautiful. I just love Florida. I love to see Panama City Beach glow up at night. All those lights make it look so magical. Yes, sister, it was so much fun and 
really eye-catching to see all those lights and all that people having so much fun in all of those attractions. In Panama City Beach at night, it seems like people never sleep because there's always people outside walking around and having fun. On our third day in Panama City Beach, when we were walking through Pier Park, we also saw this huge candy store. I was really hungry and I honestly wanted to eat all of that candy. There were big candy forms, like huge ones, and they also looked very delicious and huge. Oh yeah, my favorite part was looking at the big giant gummy bears. Oh, there was a big variety of candy, different colors, different sizes, different shapes, and different flavors. All of them were so delicious. On the fourth day, we moved to the Blue Dolphin Club. In that club, they give us the opportunity to hop on a private boat and actually go and swim with dolphins. Yes, we got the chance to get so close to dolphins, not just one or two, but a whole big family of dolphins. That was one of the most best experience that we lived there in Florida. I really liked being on a boat. It was my first time on one. And so it was time for me to go diving in the ocean with the dolphins. I've never been so close to one. Well, to a whole family of dolphins in my whole life especially because I love dolphins. We needed to wait for the captain and then we need to follow his instructions when we dive in the ocean with the dolphins. The dolphins there are so friendly because they go up to you and they love people to touch them. It was such an amazing experience. We snorkeled and swam at the Gulf of Mexico and St. Andrews Bay, where dolphins range. Here, the dolphins are constantly on the move in search of fish to eat. And they are also so friendly, as I said before. We followed the instructions from our captain for it to be the best experience. Dolphins swim constantly under us and flipping around our boat. We saw dolphins swim around just under us. That was so cool. It was so cool to see them so close. It was the best experience in my life. After swimming with the dolphin, our next stop was the Shell Island. Our captain took us to a very long drive. To Shell Island. In that island, 
Our captain let us get off our boat to get shells. We had the opportunity to walk on the shore to find shells. We filled up more than a bucket. I also found a sand dollar, stingray, and jellyfish. The only problem is that we didn't have our camera to show you guys all those beautiful stuff. Underneath us were so many fishies swimming. And as I told you before, they were sort of bothering our feet. But it also made us tickle and laugh. I will never forget about Shell Island. The sand was so white and beautiful. Yep, just like you said, sister, so beautiful. And I will never forget that as well. Day five, we went back to Panama City Beach. I was still collecting shells and discovering new things on the sea. I remember you had so much fun, sister. Making your sand castle looked so easy, but then you told me it was kind of difficult. But it was worth it, sister. Oh yeah, it was so difficult. But at least I made one. Yes, but it was worth it, sister. As I said before, it turned out to be so beautiful. I wish I did it with you. But hey, I was swimming in the ocean. It was your spotlight. Thank you, sister. I also like swimming in the ocean. I also like splashing in the water. On our sixth day, we went to this shell store. It's called Shellport, but it was so beautiful. There were so many shells, different types, smooth, rough. I could listen to them. Small, huge, and even like decorations. I don't know how they did this, but that's art. Do you know what's a good idea? To make a video of the things we bought. We brought from Panama City Beach. Great idea, sister. Make sure to stay tuned for that video. Oh, and I really liked seeing the hermit crabs. There were Superman, Batman, everything. And now, guess what, sister? Tell me. We have arrived at our last day of our vacations. I know, sister. This is our last day. I have in my heart the most beautiful moments in the beach with our family. That's the most beautiful part, that all the experiences that we lived now stays in our hearts.
And when we went to the beach one last time, there was a beautiful rainbow sort of telling us that this isn't a goodbye forever. It's sort of like see you later or see you next time. Because we know this isn't going to be the last time we visit the ocean. We want to give a special thank you to our daddy. Because without him, we wouldn't have this great adventure. Not only we packed up our clothes, but we brought our beautiful memories. Yep, memories that will always stay in our hearts forever. Florida, we're not saying goodbye. More like, see you next time. Oh.